So we are out here in Quartzsite, Arizona. We are doing the Heimer meetup group where we're doing hacks and mods and we've got all these vans out here where they're all Heimer actives. Getting all these different modifications done. We can either have our inverters up to code and fixed. We're doing USB installs for the back because we didn't have a USB plug in the back so we could charge our phone at night. And we're doing e-guard. So what they're doing over here are the e-guards, which will protect our underhood generators. I just wanted to say a huge thanks to all of the instructors. This is Liam Wong. He is installing a vent cover on top of the gray water vent to keep bugs out and still be able to vent the gray water tank. Thank you. So Sam, okay. why is it that we're doing all this? Why is this important? Well, because it's 30 amp service, the code requires this wire to be 10 gauge, which is pretty heavy. And what is it now? code requires 10 and 12 by the way this the bigger the number the smaller the wire so that's okay. funny uh, we're having a lot of fun over here lots of different mods and hacks are being done and we're gonna go check out Jim's uh, new setup over here for his bed I'll go get him. <laughs> yeah, let's get Jim over here. Yeah. So everybody yeah. wants to see his bed. Good morning. All right, this is Jim. Yeah. Jim showing off our, yeah. our van. And we, uh, we weren't satisfied with the access to the storage when we got it. So we, one of the things we did is make this cabinet so we could oh, cool. access from the top and put in movable Oh, that's like lots bins. of storage, uh-huh. Yeah, and you can pull everything out from the top okay. or use the original. That's really cool. And then we have a couple of uh, we got little closets storage over closets. There. Yeah. This is phenomenal. And those little chunks of black walnut I had laying around mm -hmm. for the trim. Nice. And you can see his bed is up. You'll have to show us how to get up. your bed up and down. The tire goes in here. Okay, the tire. How do you get it in there? This all comes out. There's a couple oh, of clips okay. and this whole thing. If you're just getting the tire, you just slide it out halfway. Gotcha. So, so how, how does this come off? Yeah. There's so I, two. So and when the grandkids come, I like see here. So you don't need so there's okay. two clips like this, yeah. one here, one up there, and then you loosen this guy with your hand, okay. and then it comes out. Okay. We don't want to pull the whole thing out. Cool. Do you want to show us how you do your bed? So we're going to see his bed come down. Look at that. That is just a touch of a button. That came down pretty quickly. And there's another button in the front, so when we're indoors, it. you can run it from either side. So, so we if, don't have if we all wanted to get that installed, you're, you're taking requests? No, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> Dang. It would, it would I tried to get that on video. <laughs> I'm, I'm afraid it would double the price of the van. Yeah, so yeah. That would be a problem. That's super cool. It worked? Cool. Oh, Thank you for good. showing us that, Jim. Sure, sure. All right. Okay. We're going to keep going. <laughs> all right, guys. That's Hello. Hello. Hi, Hi Facebook Live. This is on the owners and wannabes. So what are you doing here? Uh, this is uh, Mark Wiley. Sliding door. Your sliding I became door. a Sam disciple. <laughs> hey, this is door know? number 13. Oh. <laughs> what is it? Conquer and divide? Yeah, like that. Divide and conquer? I think I have it the other way around. <laughs> cool. So uh, Mark is fixing the sliding doors. He's going around to each rig. And grinding, it's quite a difference. Grinding yeah, metal. huge difference. Yeah, did it make a difference? It really did make a difference, a big difference. Yeah. And look, we have Michael down here. Yeah. What happened to your stub? First it stuck in, uh -huh. and then the next day it stuck out. So oh, goodness. Just took, this, took the step off, and now Sam right now is better to take the whole apparatus off okay. to reassemble the step and then put it back on. So okay. we're that's probably smart. So, okay. see how it goes. And we had our campfire out here last night, just straight ahead. And everybody just really pitched in to help. 
uh, get all of these modifications done. We've made a huge headway. Uh, we're actually ahead of schedule on some items. Hello. This is Liam, everybody. So, Liam, you installed the vent covers, right? Yep. How many did you do? Uh, I have completed three and two more to go. Cool. Yeah. Pretty easy, right? Pretty straightforward. Yep. Okay. Thank you. I appreciate your help. And then you're also doing the USB. Yeah. Okay. Right now, I'm trying to fix my own van first. Oh, no. What happened? And uh, there's no electricity. Oh, uh, no. Apparently, the bomber connector is corroded. Okay. So, we're doing the cleaning and try to move the bomber from the bottom to the top. Okay. Uh, let's see what happens. See what happens. Well, hopefully, you can get right it fixed. Gotta keep the finger crossed. Fingers crossed for sure. Yeah. Fingers crossed. <laughs> and then uh, we will continue to do the USB installation. Okay. Thank you. I appreciate uh, all your help. You're welcome. You've been great. Thank you. Yeah. This is uh, Sam's rig. He's out and about somewhere. Hello. Sam's over there, Amber. Oh, is he? Okay, I'll go over there. He's working on tear. He's a converter. I'm eating French toast. Okay. And organic bananas. Yum, that looks good. Thank you very much. Uh-huh. So ha have you had a good time out here? Fantastic. This is Lee, by the way, if you can see her name tag. Yes, you can see yes, her name tag. Yes, name tag. I would have come from Africa. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Sarah. And the weather is perfect. We've it's had great, fabulous isn't it? time, fabulous time fixing all these things. Great, I'm so yeah, it's excited. Been great. I'm and meeting really great people. Mm -hmm. That's been the fantastic part, hasn't it? Yes, I it think has. so. Yeah. We've all been able to get these mods done and then meet everybody and yeah. Mm -hmm. I've had a good time. Did you already get your inverter fixed? Yes. yes. We've okay. Had the and you're doing done. the guard. We've had the labeling yes. done. Okay. We've had the sliding door done. Nice. Put the USB plug in. You did do USB? Not going yeah. to. Okay, good. I know Bob's sure. working on mine right now and he's making the rounds. We might have Matt move the, um, what's that thing called? The down below Belmar? here. Belmar? Oh. Belmar up. Oh, okay. Yeah. So it's not. And why would we need to do that? Because Just it's, it's better more protected. vulnerable down there. It's better protected up there. If you have the e-guard on, would it we not protect it? Yes. it? You still get, you can still get moisture okay. and dirt in there. Oh, good idea. Okay. Especially in Vancouver. Oh, yeah, that's British true. Columbia. Yeah, mm -hmm. there's a lot of moisture there for sure. Yeah. Ciao. All right, thank you. Ciao, ciao. See ya. Ciao, fella. Everyone's having a party. Yeah. <laughs> so, oh, you took the door off to do the inverter. So Sam is doing all the inverter repairs. Yep. Um, I actually did, he did mine this morning. Uh, we did a video on it, so I'll be able to put that up, out at some point in time. Oh, hi. Hello. <laughs> hi, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, are you sure about that? So anyways, you can see we're having a good time out here and getting a bunch of installs done, so. Bye everyone.